Mother, I uh, hope you weren't planning on leaving without saying goodbye. Can I talk to you for a minute? Don't you have a plane to catch? I do, but... International not... flights, they like you there early. Ned, please, I'm trying to apologize. <clears throat> My mind is racing. For which of your transgressions would you like to apologize for? Destroying my marriage? Uh, running into Jenny? I can't forget your embarrassing attempt to steal my job. How about your general pathetic record as a mother? Should I just take my pick? I'm sorry. No. You're lucky. Because you should be in jail right now for what you did to Jenny. It was an accident. Okay. Uh, maybe running into her was an accident. But running away from her, sure as hell wasn't. I just panicked, Ned. I didn't know what to do. <laughs> you knew well enough to cover your ass, didn't you? You know, Ned, if you were in this position, I would stand by you. Do you know what's so incredibly sad about that statement? Right here, right now, you actually believe that. All the things, all the rotten things that you've done to me in the past, you're able to just erase from your memory. No. It's not true. I know that I've done some things that have been less than prudent. I get carried away. Carried away? You care about one thing in this life, Mother. Yourself. I care about you. I love you. You know, Mother, it's, um, it's not easy. It's not easy having you as a mother. I don't suppose it is. I want you to know that I, that I, um, I, I don't wish you any harm. And I, and I just, well, I, I know I, I act like I do sometimes, but it's, it's just because. Just because. Well, you know, it's not like we're never going to see each other again. I mean, maybe after some time you can, um, we can come together and we can maybe, um, have a relationship, have something. I'd like to hold you. Will you let me? Intend to say goodbye to your father. Does he intend to say goodbye to me? He's very hurt, Tracy. Well, imagine how I feel being thrown out of my own home. Oh, Tracy, please. For once, do be honest with yourself. You're not happy here, dear. Your father and I discussed it, and though I don't agree with his methods, I can't disagree that it's time for you to... Find some place new. Start afresh. Some place new. Oh, Tracy, you have so much to learn about life, dear. And now you have Dylan to think of. What about Dylan? Oh, he's still so little. And these years are so precious. What does that mean, Mother? 
Now I have a second chance. You hope I won't blow it? Well, I just hope you learn some valuable lessons along the way. I think I've learned some lessons along the way. Thank you. Then how on earth can you stand to leave little Dylan behind? Mother, I gave Paul joint custody. Isn't that what everybody was falling over themselves to get me to do? Because it was the right thing to do, but... <sighs> Mother, I'm going to Haiti to get my divorce, all right? I don't know where I'm going. Paul is going to look after Dylan until I'm settled and I send for him. Did you honestly think I could leave my baby behind? I don't know, Tracy. I've given up trying to outguess you. He is the only person on this earth that makes me feel special. He loves me. Oh, Tracy, that's not true. Your whole family loves you. My whole family wants me out. Because we love you, dear. Because it's best for you now. And it's not forever. <sighs> Please trust us. Who's going on vacation? I am. Where are you going? Just sort of one of those improvisational trips. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. You stay sober. I am. Look. I know what you're capable of. You're starting to think like a quarterback. Now, right now, I'm not sure if that's good or bad, but I know that it's a talent, and I don't want you to waste it. I won't. Besides, we could make a good team. Yeah, driver's ready, Mrs. Hornsby. Ms. Quatermain. You. Watch your step. It's a jungle out there. Do the same one, Tracy. Tracy, you know how much I love you. I, uh, I'm sorry for so many things. But what I'm most sorry for is for being such a disappointment to you. Tracy, Tracy, I want you to think very hard whilst you're away. Think about everything that's happened and why it's happened. I don't want you ever to go through this kind of pain again, dear. You don't have to, you know. Do you know how much I love you? I know, I know. And I love you. Now, I, I want to hear from you. I, I need to know where you are and what you're doing. Please promise to keep in touch. I promise. Hmm. Goodbye, my darling. Goodbye.